Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah and today we're continuing our Rags to Riches series. I haven't filmed this series in a while because I've been so preoccupied with my other Let's Plays, but I did a poll if you guys wanted to do Rags or BitLife today and Rags won by a lot. <laughs> So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. I'm excited to get back into it and I think I want to try and do the rocket ship thing and explore the alien planet some more. Maybe we can get some of those plants from there because they are worth a lot of money. And I'm also glad that you guys really like the new boyfriend that I made for Lilo. I think he's perfect, so I'm really excited to see where they go in this Let's Play. All right, without any further ado, let's get into the episode. Okay guys, here we are back in the, what's her last name again? I think it's Kalani. The back in the Kalani household. It looks like Kian is still here. Um, what's he gonna do? What are you doing? What are you doing? Getting something to eat? I'm pretty sure we invited him to stay the night last time, and that's why he's still here. But this nasty food, it can, like, go away, please. Please go away. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> that's still good. Okay, well, he is just having some juice, I think that is. I don't know. But in case you guys missed the last episode, this is Kian. This is the man candy I made for Lilo. They get along really, 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 really well. And uh, he has good traits. Loves the outdoors. He's family oriented. We actually don't know his other trait. Wow. Um, but he's a conservationist. I think he's pretty high in his career too, which is good. So um, it was Christmas last episode too, I think. And Santa gave us a gaming mat. He always comes through with like really good gifts in these challenges, but we sold it. So we have a good amount of money right now. It is almost the end of winter, so our plants will be back in season, thank god, because we need like some sort of income. Oh my gosh, Afu, I heard you and Kian started dating. Congrats on landing a new boyfriend. <laughs> you had your chance don't be sending me those condescending text messages what are you having for breakfast some yogi okay i think um what we're gonna do is buy a refrigerator since we can afford it i know that we're trying to save up for this rocket ship but um i really want a fridge like really badly so we'll just stick it next to the bed right here and we can get um Hmm, let's just get this one. Boom, yay, so now we can have leftovers, which is great. Oh no, what's wrong? Stomach bug? Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay. Um. Water saving flush, throw up, please. Does that make you feel better? You still have a stomach bug? Okay, well, can you order medicine? I don't think you can since we're off the grid. New Year's Eve starts tomorrow. How fun. Isn't this what you were eating that made you sick? You're just gonna eat it again? Okay, that's fine, I guess. <laughs> oh, really? Another text message. We get it, we got it the first time. So we have absolutely nothing in our inventory. That's really, really pathetic. I'm just gonna scour the beach for some she shells really quick. I wonder if they fixed the um, the seashell glitch. I know they fixed a lot of glitches in Island Living with this recent update. Um, no fish yet, okay, okay. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping they didn't fix that because these were little lifesavers. Let's find out. It's cold? It's cool, you're fine. Oh. Oh, 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 okay, we got five, which is pretty dang good. Better than one. <laughs> I'm glad they didn't really fix that. All right, let's see what else there is. Any other seashells that I can grab? Aha! Found you. Oh, this is a good one. Aha, uh -huh. we got seven that time. Boom, okay, if you're cold, perhaps you should change your outfit. Uh oh, she's gonna throw up. <gasps> Are you? Oh, you poor thing. I think you have, um, what is that from? Warm, okay. No, you're still off the grid, that's freaking annoying ding 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 
Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, look! She decided to take the boat! <laughs> That's cool. Oh my gosh, there's a storm. What am I doing out here? Yo, true. This was a bad time to go exploring. Alright, let's just search this really quick and then you can get your butt back home. Because this probably isn't a good idea being out here. Ooh, I found a tulip shell. This is a good pile right here, guys. Look at that! Oh my gosh. 7, 8, 9, 10. Let's go home, let's go home, let's go home, let's go home. See how much money we get. Yes, 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 yes. So her fun- oh, it stopped raining! Yay! Whoop. Oh, I asked you guys if you thought it would be cool if her and Kian had babies already. <laughs> and you guys were like, what the heck? Some of you were like, no, and then some of you were like, yeah, do it, yeah, do it. I think it would be fun. And I'm, like, really, really curious to see what kind of, like, what their baby would look like. And how fun would it be to have, like, a little island baby? All right. It looks like she's super hungry. So where's that little food stall? Oh, what's going on over here? Ooh, this looks fun. Um, Cozy up. Cozy up with Kian. Is he there? He's gotta be, otherwise why are they- Oh! Cute! Cute, cute, cute! Oh, she looks really uncomfortable, though. What the heck? That's not very cool of you. Can you, like, roast a marshmallow or a hot dog or something? Because your mood is really killing the vibe. I'm sure he's trying to have fun and you're just there with that stank face. Where's that little bar? Here it is. Is the food stall open right now? No? Whack. Alright, let's visit the bar. Let's go with, um... Let's go with Afu, and then we can invite Kian as well. Um... Let's invite her too. She was like a potential friend that we have for Lilo. I think it would be nice for her to have a friend. That's like something I'm really bad at in The Sims. Like, I never have like close friends. And it, whenever it times to like, whenever, it, whenever it's time to like get married or do something, there's like no one there because I have no friends. So yeah, that's pretty relatable. <laughs> so I'm gonna try my hardest to uh, get her some friends in this, and not just a boyfriend. There's more to life than having a boyfriend. So why don't you? Say what's up to her. Hug him. This is a cool little group we got going on. What if they got together? Oh my gosh, can't you like do that? Let's see. I thought you could. I thought you could be like, hey, you should... Why is there a plant right there? Uh, I thought we could be like, or she could be like, hey, you should date so-and-so. And then they'll be like, oh, really? Okay. I'll go talk to him. Order ladies' night drink. It's ladies' night. Ooh, let's get a plasma jane. That looks good. $22 drink. I wish Sims liked the storms. I love the storm. Antiseptic. I love, like, especially when they're inside, like, they're fine. You should just chill. Watch Simder. No, I want to tell him to give him a romantic gift. No, I want to tell him to, um, date the other chick. How do I do that? Other Sims, here we go. Hook up with... What? Why isn't she here? Did she leave? Do not hook up with Kian, are you joking? No, she's here. She's sleeping on the bench outside, okay. Yay, everyone is dancing. Dang, she's got moves. What the? Oh! Okay, why have I never seen a sim do that before? 
Yo. Yo, she's my new favorite. Oh my gosh, did Afu leave? Nope, he's there behind the bar. Okay, what if we told her then? Like, hey, you should. Why can't I tell her to hook up? Talk up another sim, talk up Afu. And then with him, we can do the hook up thing. Why isn't she here? Does she have a boyfriend? Let's find out. Wow, I'd love to get to know him. Yeah, you should. There it is! Hook up with her. Cause then like we can go on like group dates like this. What? I don't know, Felipe, you're I don't know, Felipe, you're not very convincing. This guy's a jerk. He is. Okay, what if we talked her up? She doesn't sound that interesting. Well, <laughs> screw you. How about that? What about Daniela? She's another option that we have as a friend. I think she's beautiful. This is her. I made her in a gender bend. She's so, like, exotic looking. Like, Italian or something like that. We can try that. Let's see. Let's see what he says about her. Okay, she's not there. Um, okay, cool. Let's see what he says about her. Wow, I'd love to get to know her. Okay, so he just didn't find uh, uh, Philippa to be attractive. I spoke with Daniela and found her quite pleasing. He doesn't- oh no! Now she doesn't like him! <laughs> oh my gosh! Why? Why is this happening? And like, why are you dancing behind the bar? Oh, okay. Well, I give up on trying to find Afu a girlfriend, because like, wow. Declare weather preference. Declare love for... Rain. Maybe that'll like keep her from freaking out about the storm. All right, I'm gonna get her to order some food because she's pretty hungry. Let's see what the options are: curry wurst, fish and chips, French fries, meat and cheese platter, pita and hummus tapas, a pretzel, grab chips. Man, let's get a pretzel. That sounds really bomb. I want a pretzel from Disneyland. She's having fun. Everyone seems to like her. She's still dancing. I'm gonna max that skill tonight. <laughs> you danced all night, and now you're having yourself a pretzel. Oh, this is the bartender that finds us boring. What are you ordering? It's New Year's Eve! <gasps> Maybe we could find Lilo like a super pretty dress to wear and we can come to this bar. Is there- yeah, there's a TV in here. It's so, so, so tiny, but like, maybe we can put like a bigger one on the wall. Let's see. I always do this when it's New Year's. I get like a bigger TV so that they can watch the countdown together, everyone at the bar can. It's pretty fun. Ah, here we go. Like, should we get this one? <laughs> it's gigantic. Uh, this one fits better. Okay, yeah. So they can all watch the countdown here tonight. Um, yeah, so she should probably head home and rest up for that, even though she just ordered another drink. Girl, you are something else. She is starting early. Okay, I am now on a mission to find Afu a girlfriend. How about this girl? Do we know her? Let's see. Let's um let's see if she likes him. Boom. Alright. He's all sitting right here and we're like, hey! <laughs> this guy's pretty cool. 
Let's see what she says. Hina! Wow, I'd love to get to know him. Okay, okay. Pause. Pause. Hold the phone. What's her name? Ha Halia Parata. Oh no, they're related! <gasps> what? Wait. Wait. <laughs> Hold on, where's the ask about siblings thing? Here we go. Ask about siblings. <laughs> Afu is, wait, what? I'm an only child. What? Is that like your mom or something? What is going on here? You guys have the same last name. Okay, I can tell him to hook up with her, so they must not be related. Let's see. Let's see what he says. I don't know. It's always like they don't like him or he doesn't or he doesn't like them. It's so annoying. Okay, let's head home. I'm honestly done trying to find a girlfriend for you. You're like you're a jerk, honestly. Well, he is a snob, so I guess this girl has to be like amazing for him to want to be with her. Home sweet home. You had a long night, didn't you? Use the bathroom, darling. What are you dazed from? Oh, she's a little drunkies. You poor dear. Just have yourself a nice pee and then go to sleep. What are you doing? Use. In the morning, we'll find her a new outfit and then she can head back to the bar probably <laughs> i'm so happy it's the last day of winter like we need our plants to be in season again hey look there's an element on our lot how much is that worth what why whack good morning Oh no, she has a bladder infection. No! Ugh. All right, let's have some, let's have some baked potatoes for dinner. And then we can head on down to the bar. Okay, let's find her an outfit to wear tonight. Uh, I really wanna dress her glam, but it's like, I don't know. Lava. She's like living on an island. Does, ever, does anyone ever dress glam on an island? What's her formal wear right now? Oh yeah. <gasps> Man, that's so pretty. Oh, and I wanted to take her tattoos off. There we go, okay. Dang, I really like this color. Does it match her eyes? It kind of does, a little bit. Let's just add another one and see what else we have here. We've got this glittery one, which is like my favorite dress to use on New Year's Eve. Oh, it's just so pretty, but is it too much? <laughs> like, imagine her walking in the sand in this. Like, wow, that would be a lot. That's pretty. Ooh, that's gorgeous. I don't know, would she get cold? What if she just went in like a full on gown? That would be so funny. That's pretty. It's so shiny. Wow. Wow. Lilo is so pretty. It hurts. I think we're gonna keep it with the first one. Yeah, this one. Either the green or the blue. Let's do the green. Okay, yeah, definitely those. Just the outfit that she already had on. <laughs> Let's put on some nails. Um, I like white. She's ready. She is ready for some New Year's Eve fun. What time is it? Oh my gosh, I hope it's not past 12. I think it was like 11.30, wasn't it? Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh! Wow! We suck. I doubt we'll make it there in time. 
I highly, highly, highly doubt it. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> we have four seconds! <laughs> oh yeah, it's this bar, right? Yeah, okay. Let's go. Singles night, huh? Alright, so time is paused. There isn't anyone here. Watch countdown to midnight. You gonna make it? Are you gonna make it? No! You didn't make it! No! <laughs> I suck at this. I seriously suck at this. Oh! It worked! She did it! Even though it's after 12. Alright, let's get these um, little thingies up. So she wants to decorate, which we're not going to. She wants to have a party spirit, make resolution. Okay, yeah, we can do that. Make a resolution. Let's do... Mm, let's just do the raise the skill one. We don't know anyone here. Where is everyone that we invited? Come on, throw the confetti. It's over? We got all dressed up for nothing! Where the heck is our man? Oh my gosh, this guy. He's always trying to talk to us. Like, everywhere we go, he's just there. What you eating? Oh yeah, baked potatoes in your inventory, I forgot. Let's put them out for everyone. <laughs> Since we're here, you might as well get all of these shelly shells before we go back home. Yay, it's spring! That means we can finally do our plants. It's about time. Okay, let's go home. I would be so uncomfortable if I was her, walking in the sand in heels and like a tight dress like that. <laughs> Sorry making you do that. <laughs> that was like the worst New Year's ever. I can't believe like how much of a fail that was. She was dreaming of baby bottles, you guys. Do you want to go out on a date? Where to? No, that's not on the island. We got some raw talent here, folks. We only need a few more dollars. Maybe not a few more, we just need like $700 more to get the rocket ship. Oh, look at how cute that is. So let's get these Shelly shells. That was such a good pile. Look at all of the ones we got. $480? You guys, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get the ship. Yes! We're gonna get it! We're gonna get the ship! Alright. Time to go home. We got stuff to do. Sorry to interrupt your sandcastle building. Alright, we're back. So let's see what we can do. Here it is. I hope this is the right one. Or is this the one? Oh gosh, I don't know! We gotta build it. So let's just move this tree. We'll have this be over here, and then... I guess this tree can like block it to the public. So no one really knows what's going on. All right, cool. We have $137 left, so let's see what we can do. Lilo can't, oh my gosh, really? You need $1,000 to build it? That is so annoying. <laughs> Come on. Okay, after a long night, long day of looking for seashells, we almost have enough. So I think 
once I get the seashells from today, I think we should be good and then we'll be able to build the ship. Do you guys think that it's unfair that this like seashell hack is like making this way too easy? <laughs> Rebate day, huh? We totally could have built the or got the rocket ship today and gotten money back. Wow. All right, back home. Let's see if we will have enough. Doesn't look like it. Oh my gosh, yes, we will. Woo! Okay, let's get it going. Build it. Build that rocket. She acquired the rocket science skill. She can now build rockets, upgrade the landing stabilizers, and explore space. How exciting. Look at her go. Oh no, our plants. They look really bad. Ooh, but they're ready to be harvested. Okay, why don't you take a break and have some food? Yay, resolution complete. She reached handiness levels two. Good for you, girl. Yeah, rake in that money. We get 15 bucks per coconut tree. That's pretty good. All right, time to continue building. Um, she is, oh my gosh, taking showers off the grid. She really doesn't like it. She's always so uncomfortable afterwards. And it looks like this rocket's gonna take us a while to build. Like that is our progress so far. <laughs> Woo, level two of the rocket science skill. Way to go. Go ahead and talk to your plants. That'll get your social skill up, right? Without having to leave the lot. <laughs> Let's see. It's working. There we go. All good, all on the green now. Let's continue building this ship. I know this is kind of boring and I'm sorry, but I just want to get this ship done so we can go to the planet. Okay guys, so once she wakes up today, she should be able to finish her rocket. Um, Cause it's like almost done. Does it show you a progress bar? No, okay, but she's almost done. Okay, so as you guys can see, we're like almost there. It just needs like a little tiny bit more. You can do it. I know that your fun is really low right now, but you can do this. You can do this, you can do this, you can do this. And... You finished! Good job! Oh my gosh, okay, let's go. Oh my god, you guys. I have never done this before. Look at her, she's in a... Oh my god, she's in an astronaut suit. This is so cool. Have you guys ever done this before? Because I haven't. I think this is awesome. Bzz, Lilo, come in. Bzz. Commander Vanderwater needs your help. There is a satellite out in orbit that is malfunctioning. Millions of Sims are complaining about their poor cell phone data coverage. They want to post pics of their food, their kittens, and their profound fortune cookies, but can't. The commander needs Lilo to take a look. Go check it out. Wait a minute. I thought we were supposed to go to Sig Sam. Why aren't we there? Lilo arrives at the satellite and notices it's covered in a light pink gloop, but why? What is it? Try to clean it. Why would you shoot at it? It might destroy the satellite. Lilo suits up, opens the door, and floats towards the satellite. As she gets closer, Lilo notices that there are sprinkles in the goop. What? Lilo pulls out her space chamois and wipes them off. She snips it and then takes a taste. It's frosting. Lilo takes a sample for lab analysis and for a snack, then returns to the ship. <laughs> That's funny. All of a sudden, Lilo sees a big shadow. She quickly looks to see a giant pastry freezer bunny floating by. It looks like it has, it has its eyes focused on another satellite and starts to shoot pink frosting. Blast it. Without the super ion cannons, the blast bounces right off the bunny. The angry bunny turns towards Lilo's ship, but luckily she gets away. Return home. Lilo found some space debris. What is space debris, and what can we do with this? Well, that was lame. I thought we were going to be able to go to the planet. Install landing stabilizers. Maybe we need that in order to land on a planet. Oh, extra food. Thanks, guys. How'd you know I wasn't hungry? <laughs> uh, 
invite neighbors in. They can clearly see my rocket ship. That tree isn't really doing much. She can hang out for a bit, get her social up. Thank you for the food. We're just going to stick that right in our refrigerator. <laughs> this is exactly why we got the fridge. She can now upgrade to improve maneuvering thrusters on rockets. I wonder what all of this means. Yay! Cool. Okay. Come on, come to sleep, and then tomorrow we can... Explore. Oh, look, Kai's, or Kian's here. Um, let's just joke about old times really quickly. Um, grab some leftovers, and then we're gonna get our butt to space. Why aren't you saying anything to him? All right. Oh my gosh, we can woohoo with him in the rocket ship. Let's do that really quick. That's fun. We didn't build this rocket ship for nothing, you know what I mean? <gasps> Oh my god, this is amazing. <laughs> oh, I never knew how cool this was. If I had known, I would have done this so long ago. <laughs> 50 Mile High Club. She's confident from that. That's so funny. He's like, whoa, I need to wash my hands after that one. Lilo doesn't remember much, but thinks she may have been abducted. She now stands in a small, sterile arena. A motley assemblage of hideous beings sits furtiv furtively in the bleachers. Slowly, a pedest pedestal rises from the floor. Oh, a pedestal rises from the, store from the floor. It contains two items, a ball and a container with two holes, one round and one triangular. The room is tense with excitement. Put ball in round hole, obviously. The round ball definitely slides into the round hole, and the room erupts into ferocious applause. Lilo instinctively bows graciously as the puzzle recedes back into the floor, replaced by a new one. This next rising pedestal has a hat, a very fine hat, perhaps a derby. What should Lilo do? Wear it. Eureka! The hat goes on the head. More cheers spew forth from the crowd as Lilo rifles the hat into the stands with a flourish to be caught by one lucky fan. The hatless pedestal sinks and disappears into the ground and it is shortly replaced again. The latest test pedestal appears to ha hold a chair. A simple metal chair. Sit in it. The answers seem to be obvious. Lilo is pro at putting her butt into a butt reception into butt reception areas. She sits down without incident and the crowd goes wild, but they're not cheering, they're laughing. The pedestal chair Lilo sinks into the floor just like the other test. Lilo is swallowed by the machination dumped unceremoniously into a rocket and blasted home. Wow. I'm thinking we're gonna have to like upgrade like all the aspects of our rocket in order to get places. Man, that sucks. I was really getting into it too. Okay, we're gonna go to explore space one more time in this episode. And if we don't get there, then it is what it is. She can now expand ca the cargo bay. No, I don't wanna go to night bar. Night, night bar. Night, night at the bar. <laughs> okay. Yay. All right, let's go. Lilo is filling up on rocket fuel when an alien spacecraft pulls up next to the pump next to her. Lilo doesn't think much of it until she sees the alien loading crates onto her ship. The space police are after me. The alien shouts, hide this stuff. I promise I'll make it worth it. Lilo is still choking on the alien spacecraft exhaust when she hears sirens blaring in the distance. The space police surround Lilo's rocket ship and demand to search her cargo bay. She can turn over the goods and hope for the best or help the alien and possibly herself by hiding it. Hide it. Luckily, the police captain seems to be into Lilo. <laughs> With a dash of charm and some crafty fast talk, Lilo distracts the cop from performing a thorough search, and the police are gone in no time. Now Lilo just has to find her alien friend. Lilo pilots her ship to a remote rest stop, but she is, but just as she's about to pry open the first crate, she notices a small red flashing light. A tracker. Just then, the alien knocks at her window. As the smuggler unloads the stuff, he slips Lilo a small package and thanks for va before vanishing in a cloud of exhaust. We got a fossilized alien skull. $250. I don't think that was worth it at all. <laughs> <sighs> I 
I think we'll keep it. Um, maybe we could sell it at a yard sale and get like way more than what it's worth. But I'm going to leave this part right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I can't believe we finally have a rocket ship. I just hope that in the next episode we can like make it to another planet because that was the whole reason why I wanted to build this ship. Anyway, <laughs> if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. That would make me so happy and you won't miss another video. And I'll see you in my next one. Love you. Bye.